Hi, I'm Michael Vermette, and I'm an impasto painter, which means I paint very thickly with oil paint, and I'm also a very bold watercolor painter. I'm the first Allagash Wilderness Waterway artist. Very honored to have had that opportunity to paint in the Allagash. So when I found out about it, of course, I was extremely elated. Both my hope and my goal is to do 50 paintings in two weeks, uh, which is a lot. Um, they're generally smaller paintings, 8x10 in oil and 11x15 in watercolor. <clears throat> well, what inspired 50 paintings of art was that this was the 50th anniversary of the Allagash Wilderness Waterway. And by the time I have the show, it'll be one more year, so 50 plus one. The reason why I, I think um, an artist should actually go to this is because it's so remote. It's probably the most remote place in the state of Maine. And the other reason is it's a unique geodetic area that's been set aside uh, where you're going to experience nature directly. But the Allagash is the most preserved, out of the way place. And literally, you don't come across people for hours upon end and days on end. You can be totally alone with your subject. And I think uh, that's, that's, that's cool all in itself. That's a, that's a great um, experience as an artist. You're going to be left alone. One of the paintings I want to do very large is the whole galaxy you see the whole Milky Way. And uh, when I came back to my camp, I saw the whole Milky Way over the locked in camp. And that was extraordinary. So um, you have this ever changing environment around you and you're in it. So you're, you have to keep quite a routine to keep the cabin up and also be able to do your painting at the same time. You have a wonderful porch you can paint off of. So if you're an oil painter and you're worried about you know, fumes, you can actually separate your uh, paint from your living quarters. And I think the, the biggest recommendation um, is to never try to do this alone. <laughs> if I had one other person with me, and I did at my last week uh, I had for four days, I was able to do a, a lot more, and uh, it, was, it was a lot more fun to have someone with you. It's always been said that beauty can save the world. This is our role as artists, is to create the beauty from nature that's going to make the change and be the change that's going to make it more tolerable. When we have to quarantine or socially distance, it makes life a whole lot more bearable. It really completes the cycle when someone buys a work of art because they have to have that beauty in their life.